Let's say your boss just got off the phone with a critical customer. He then asks you to design this platform structure on the customer's tight schedule. How long would you estimate that it would take you? Hours? Days? Weeks? More? Designing this would include creating each beam to an engineering standard, trimming adding well gaps to each beam, creating an itemized cut list, and making the overall model adaptable to design changes. So a few years ago, I was asked to model a variation of this same structure. Unfortunately, I spent way too much time on a not so versatile model because I didn't know about the built-in weldment tools. Now I don't want you to be like I was and waste days of time on projects that have easier solutions. So let's dive into what weldments can do for you so that you can stop wasting time and start using weldments. SolidWorks makes the creation of structural members very automated so that you can quickly make your designs with confidence and accuracy. Predefined beam types from a set of industry standards are available so that you don't have to rummage through textbooks for dimensions or start from scratch for each new beam. From here, it's as easy as selecting the sketch lines you want the beam to follow and the beams are created. Trimming beams to fit together correctly is made easy by incorporating most of your trims inside the beam creation tool. For more complex trims between different beam types, all you have to do is select the beams you want to trim and then select the beams that create the trim boundary. From there, just enter the desired weld gap and SolidWorks does the rest. Trimming is done automatically so you can have confidence that your designs assemble together correctly the first time. When you are ready for manufacturing, SolidWorks automatically creates a cut list of all beams in your model so you can get your designs manufactured quickly. SolidWorks recognizes when different beams have the exact same geometry and automatically groups them together to make an efficient cut list. With a few clicks, you can add a dynamically linked cut list table to your drawing and get started on the manufacturing process. So we now have our detailed model, but let's say that we just got word from the customer that the structure now has to withstand a greater amount of weight. A design changes in order, but thankfully we do not have to start from scratch. The automation that goes on behind the scenes makes most design changes quick and easy so that you don't have to worry about manually changing every part of the design. In a few clicks, we can edit the beams to a different standard size. From there, the beams are automatically updated along with all the weld gaps, the effective beam lengths, and the cut list. Now, if you have a SOLIDWORKS simulation license, you could run a structural simulation to determine if it now meets the design requirements. As you can see, by learning SOLIDWORKS weldments, you can reduce design time, have greater confidence that your designs will assemble together correctly the first time, and be ready for faster design changes. You may not know it, but if you have any type of SOLIDWORKS license, you can start using weldments today. I can't wait for you to take advantage of weldments on your next project. Stop wasting time and start using weldments. Contact MLC CAD Systems to take a weldments training class with one of our experts. We look forward to working with you soon.